The barbell back squat has been called the king of lower body exercises, and I can't say I disagree. Squat patterns are fantastic to use during pregnancy, and this is no exception. So this exercise can be used when trying to conceive and all the way through pregnancy. The only thing that you might wanna monitor is the load. As you get farther along, if you're starting to feel any downward pressure in the pelvic floor, or you're starting to feel a little bit less stable, then you might wanna decrease the load or decrease the range of motion slightly. So Jessie's gonna set up putting the bar on her back. Her hands are a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. She's gonna squeeze her upper back together and basically create a shelf for the bar. The bar should not be sitting on any bony prominences. She's gonna stand up with the bar. She's gonna take a couple steps back and she's getting a, gonna get in a squat position that feels comfortable for her. It's a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Toes turned out about 15 degrees. She's gonna make sure she's got a nice core that's lightly braced. She's gonna sit back into her hips and drive her knees out achieving the depth that is comfortable for her. And that's gonna look different for everyone. You'll see she's got a little bit of a forward lean. That's normal, and women who are a little bit taller, maybe their femurs are a little longer, torsos a little shorter. Good. Good, give us one more rep. So as you'll see, she's maintaining a nice neutral spine throughout. She's not coming up and tucking her bum under really hard at the top. She's not hyperextending at the top. She was staying nice and lightly braced through her core, driving her knees out, and the knees were tracking over the toes. Everything looked nice and solid. And so that's the barbell back squat. Again, totally safe to perform all the way through pregnancy. You just want to monitor load and how your core and your pelvic floor are feeling.